That was a ten dollar call. Hey man, can you come pick me up? I'm a little drunk on this game and I'm kind of in a bad neighborhood. <laughs> yeah. Alright, good dude, because there's this guy, like, I'm in the gas station, he's like staring at me. I'll be there in a second. Alright, dude, I, I mean, I'm kind of nervous. Thank God he picked up. Hey, Hello. you know. What up? Yeah, I've had a few too many, man. You think you could come pick me up? What's wrong? I've had a few too many. A few too many? Yeah, I'm on the verge of passing out. I've drunk a, I've drunk a lot of beers on here, man. Um. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need a pickup. Do you, I mean, you, do you have a cab service so I can, you can call me or something? Yep. Yeah. When, when are they gonna? Yeah, I right. send you an invite to my apartment. No, nah, dude, no, nah, no, nah, I can't leave my car out here. Why not? You can call your mechanic to bring it to my house. That's that doesn't sound like a good idea, cause then I have to drive home, and um, like I said, I'm kind of you know a little bit tipsy, and then I, I, I don't want to fix some dents. But your mechanic does that for free. How long have you been playing this game? Uh, not very long, but. Long enough to know that if you kill civilians, you know, you can scrape up quite a bit of beer change. <laughs> well, if I send you the invite to my apartment, then I can drive you to your house. Uh, that just, that doesn't sound too good to me right now. I mean, I'm not, you know, a big fan of, like, meeting new people and just suddenly, like, going in their house, you know? But yet you call my phone and ask me to pick you up. I mean, you sounded like a nice person when I talked to you earlier. If I just went in your house, that would... I mean, dude, that's how rape happens. I mean, that's how all that... I mean, just suit, you know, it's like... I'm, I'm trying to extend the hand of generosity. If you want to make it to your house, you got to come to mine first. I'm not going to drive and pick you up. I'm not going to leave my house with ten cars in my garage. We can ride and choose to pick from whichever how you want to get home. Get you to your house. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Can that, you, that really uh, makes okay. no sense. I can do this faster than by the time I get to you, you won't even be drunk no more. I'm looking uh, at your location on the map. So, sir, that, no, that is actually... I, I have plenty of beer on me. You, you, like, you assure that I have, I have plenty to stay drunk. Uh, oh my god, so, okay look man, um, this is getting kind of weird now, so I, I'm going to hang this conversation. No, no, hold, hold on, hold on, this is a $10 call, I mean, you know how many beers I could have bought with that? At least like yeah, three. I don't. I don't. I mean, I'm going to make it, but I'm I'm not going to lie, I'm a little bit nervous. You don't have to drive if you're really trying to come, is my point though. I mean... I gotta get to know you first. I mean, like I said earlier, I mean, weird stuff happens. You know, you gotta meet the person before you just like climb in their house or something. But the safest place to meet somebody is in their house because you cannot pull a gun on anybody in the house. Why would I pull a gun on you? I can't even walk. I'm, that's what I'm saying. If you're worried about safety, if you're worried about me killing you, then you should want to come to my house because I can't pull a gun on you in the house. I'm not worried about you, I'm worried about cops. I'm kinda drunk driving right now. Will you take me home? <laughs> Please. I'm buzzing. I got you. Uh, told you always got some spare beers. You gotta chug them, they work better. Oh, oh 
you hear me? What are we taking? Don't drive too fast. Oh, I get dizzy. Alright. You gotta let me finish. I can smoke in here, right? Yeah. Alright, that's good. Okay, let's go home. Alright, hold on. Let me put my money up real quick. You know, you about got me arrested out there. You got a warrant? Yeah, for my arrest. They're like, hey, you, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I'm not drunk anymore. This, this ain't good. We're gonna get this under control. Really quick. Bro, I can't be out here like this. Okay, let me drive. You don't need to drive in your conditions. I'm about okay. to leave you. Okay, hold on. Let me finish this. Just this one. I'm almost done. Alright. Hey, can we go to that gas station across the street? No, I'm taking your ass home. Throw a sticky bomb on their ass. Hell yeah. Good shit! Good shit! Okay. For that, I will take you to the store for that. That was great. Thank you. I, I really do need to buy some more beer. Alright. <laughs> Just for that, I will set you a waypoint to the nearest gas station. <laughs> You ever passed out before? No. Oh, watch this. I should probably get checked out as many times as I've passed out in bad neighborhoods. <laughs> probably got something. Alright, I'm about to go down. I can feel it. You gotta look at me while we drink. It just makes it better. It's like a drinking contest. Oh, there I went. Damn. Now I gotta get drunk again. I've never seen that. Yeah, you ain't never met a hardcore drinker like me either. 